Has there been any discussion at your board meetings about a replacement for your partner, longtime friend, and co-chairman Charlie, Ch Charlie Munger? Has it been determined Berkshire will continue to be led by a similar dynamic duo, two magnificent, magnificent investor minds, each providing a unique point of view, have been a major reason the business has performed magnificently over the decades and has delighted the shareholders? Well, Charlie is my, he's my canary in the coal mine. <laughs> Charlie turned 90, and I find it very encouraging how well he's handling middle age. Uh, <clears throat> so I hope to be able to do the same thing myself. Uh, no, and, uh, it, it's, uh, you raised a point which is, I'm, I haven't thought about, but I'm a little sensitive now that you raised it. They, they always talk about replacing me, but they never talk about replacing Charlie. <clears throat> I, I do think, <clears throat> I think it's very likely, incidentally, that whoever replaces me as CEO probably has, over the years, certainly, Develops. They'll never be able to develop another Charlie, but they'll develop somebody that that they work with very closely. It's 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 a great way to operate. Berkshire is better off because the two of us have worked together than if either one of us had been working individually. There's no question about that. And uh, and but I do think you know we saw it with. With Roberto Goizueta and Don Keogh at Coke, we saw it with Tom Murphy and Dan Burke at Cap Cities. I mean, these were magnificent companies. Uh, and I think that in both cases that I just named, uh, I think that they accomplished far more because they had two incredible people running them who admired and worked well with the, with the other. And, and they were, they were complementary in terms of the talents they brought in many ways. They, uh, it, 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 it's, it, it, it's a great way to operate. You can't, you can't will it to somebody, but I, I would be very surprised if a few years after my successor takes over, or maybe sooner, that there isn't some, some relationship of partnership that, that enhances uh, the CEO's uh, uh, not only not only achievements, but but the fun they have, and uh, uh, but so far nobody's brought up in the meeting any successor to Charlie. And frankly, I have a, a lot of trouble thinking of anybody that could be a successor to Charlie. <laughs> Charlie, do you want to come? I, I got to give you a chance. <laughs> I don't think the world has much to worry about. And most 90-year-old men are gone soon enough. No. The canary has spoken. Okay. 